here with May West Manufacturing. Corn harvest is just around the corner. Now is the time to outfit your corn head with GBL poly snouts. If you have existing poly snouts, now's the time to check it over and get the appropriate replacement parts needed. We get a lot of questions about GBL poly snouts. This video will help answer all those questions. The first question growers always ask, does May West manufacture GBL poly snouts? When you call GVL Poly, you will notice that the phone rings through to Maywes Manufacturing instead of GVL. Don't worry, you dialed the right number. Maywes is the exclusive distributor for GVL Poly snouts. GVL Poly snouts are manufactured by GVL Poly right down the road from us in Litchfield, Minnesota. You can order your GVL Poly Snouts through May West or your local May West dealer. Another question we often hear, do GVL Poly Snouts interface with OEM Snouts? If you have OEM Snouts, GVL Poly will usually not interface with them. But there are some exceptions. For Case IH, 3400, 3200, 2400, 2200, and New Holland 98D, 98C, 96C, and 996 series, GVL front left and front right poly will interface with OEM. John Deere 600 series, OEM snouts will interface with GVL center fronts and center back poly only. If you have OEM snouts that do not interface with GVL, you can replace an entire snout with GVL, but it might not be exactly the same length as an OEM snout. Another commonly asked question, how can I tell if my existing poly snouts are GVL? We get a lot of customers who buy a used corn head at an auction, and they are not sure if their poly snouts are GVL. GVL snouts will have the GVL logo on them, they also have white or sometimes yellow wear points. Another commonly asked question, how can I tell if I have GVL Series 1 or Series 2 poly snouts? GVL Series 1 or rigid design folds up for easy access. It has a single pivot point that allows the snout to lift up. The easiest way to identify Series 1 is to look at your back poly. Series 1 will have a hole in the rear for the hold down pin to go through. GVL Series 2 or jackknife design has double pivot points that allow the points to fold up in and down for easy access for maintenance. They also use less space for storage. GVL Series 2 back poly will be slanted and does not have any holes in the rear. For 20 and 22 inch row spacing for all Case IH 800, 900, 1000 series, John Deere 40 and 90 series, and Eggco, Hugger and 3000 series, as well as New Holland 974, you will need to determine if it is a short front or a long front. Measure from the end or the very point of the front snout all the way back to the back end of the front snout. Short snout will measure approximately 47 inches. A long snout will measure approximately 59 inches. Another commonly asked question, what component parts do we carry? We offer front and back poly, wear points, wear strips, chain adjust brackets, mainframe, and additional hardware. Another commonly asked question we get, I want to buy an entire kit for my corn head. How do I know how many rows I have? You always have two outside rows or outside snouts and your center snouts will always be one row less 
than the total number of rows needed. For example, on a six row kit, you would have one left hand snow, one right hand snow, and five centers. Another commonly asked question, what is the difference between front poly and wear points? Sometimes customers mistakenly order a front poly when all they needed was a wear point. This is a wear point and this is a front poly. Another commonly asked question we get, how do I know how many wear points do I need? You will need one wear point for each individual snout assembly. Another commonly asked question, what snout savers should I use for GVL poly snouts? May West snout savers prevent damage to your snouts by preventing them from digging into the soil. When ordering snout savers for your GVL poly snouts, make sure you order May West snout savers for poly heads. We offer them for inside and outside snouts. We also get asked, how many snout savers do I need? You will need a snout saver for every individual row unit on your horn head. For example, on an eight row head, you will need two outside snout savers, and you would need seven inside snout savers. Another commonly asked question, can I order ear savers with my GVL Poly? Yes, you will need two ear savers per row and these ear savers are sold individually. Another commonly asked question, I have a hole in my snout, how can I repair it? May West offers Poly Snout Patches made of 1 8 inch UHMW it does come with self-tapping screws and they are available in white, green, or red. Our poly snout patches are ideal for high wear areas. Other ways to help protect your snouts include stainless steel wear strips and crop divider wear kits. How long does it take GBL poly snouts to ship? Front and back poly generally ship within a day or two. Complete row units take three to five business days due to the fact the rows need to be assembled. And keep in mind, during the harvest season, lead time can be extended. Another commonly asked question, do you have snouts available for my gearing hop corn head? If your corn head was made from 1998 through 2004, we would be able to outfit your corn head with GVL Poly. If your corn head was made prior to 1998, and after 2004, unfortunately, we will not be able to get you the snouts needed for your gearing hop head. Thank you for your interest in GVL Poly Snouts. For more information, please contact your local May West dealer, check us out on the web, or give us a call 1-800-788-6483.